Top five reasons you can't blame Blair Walsh for missing that kick. Earl Thomas breaking up this Jarek McKinnon pass that would have made for a huge chunk play. Couldn't bring Russell Wilson down on a botched QB center exchange, resulting in the Seahawks' first points of the game on a touchdown to Doug Baldwin. This Adrian Peterson fumble early in the fourth quarter to allow the Seahawks to kick a go-ahead field goal. Andrew Sandejo dropping this interception late in the fourth quarter. And Blair Walsh scored all of the Vikings' points in that game, including a 43-yarder and a 47-yarder. The Vikings just could not capitalize on points at home.